a bodybuilder at its root is concerned with self-development through self-mastery. Everybody's on steroids. Everybody. Look at the guys in the Olympia stage. And you're hitting a pose. And, and then you're like... <sighs> when it comes to talking about what choice should be made, it's that unenhanced bodybuilding is the way to go. This is time right now for natural bodybuilding to grow, where everybody's seeing that health is the most important thing. I was never gonna be a man's physique. Didn't have much of an off season. I like his physique better. I'm always very energetic. I will have to put me as one of the greatest. Mr. Olympia was won by the back. I was actually gonna ask you about Hunter. How did you feel about his performance uh, at a recent show? Um, he won it, yeah. Like, how did you, did you feel like he did great in that show? Oh yeah, he did great. Of course, that was a tough contest, you know, top five. It was, it was gross, I think. You know, like, a couple guys, you know, like, I, I never seen these guys, but they are really great. I know they came out of nowhere. But Hunter, everyone knew Hunter was coming in, you know, great shape. And uh, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure he had a lot of pressure. You know, like uh, being, you know, son of a uh, great leader brother, it's also, you know, a lot of pressure, but he, he still won the show. That, that's, you know, talks of his potential. He, he had mental and he's uh, physical too. So, uh, but I, I'm saying, you know, like, uh, I, I saw a couple more guys, you know, really, really good, and uh, they'll be, they'll be in the future in a few years, you know, like uh, take over the, uh, the the bodybuilding world. So uh, I'm pretty happy with the, uh, you know, like a new generation too. Mm -hmm. So last question I have for you here is, uh, you've been competing for a while now, right? Um, since the late '90s, you mentioned, and you did a 212, you did a men's open, you were in the top stages in the world. Um, what keeps you motivated to keep going? Because you've done it all, you've seen it all. You know what I mean. What what motivates you? Is it the fact that you you know you want to hit ten Olympias, or, or you want to you want to land that big win at the end? Like what keeps you going every day to, to continue to? Right. Of course, I, I love being on the stage, but you know it's it's more like a love for sports. So I like I love uh, this lifestyle. Then uh, okay, I mean. Uh, uh, People ask me when 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 should I retire? But you know, I, I mean, I, I I was thinking about it like more like a couple of years ago. I, I should maybe I should be retiring for now. But now I, I to be honest, I mean, I have to be honest. My physique is better than ten years ago. Uh, no, you know, it's it's not it's not better anything. Not better. Like I was better ten years ago for sure. But now it's more like a love and a, uh, it's more like a hobby. It's it's not really. You know, bodybuilding, of course, it was my job. I mean, it is still my job, professional bodybuilder, but it's not making, you know, much money for me anymore, right? I spend more money, you know, training and, you know, all this stuff, diet, you know. I make money from other things. So uh, it's not really my job anymore. It's more like a hobby and a lot. So uh, I just keep, you know, com continue competing unless I, you know, like one day I, you know, like everything too, too hurt too much and I, to compete. Like if I feel that way, I'll, I'll retire. But as long as I, I, I'm healthy, I, I just keep com you know, uh, competing. And uh, I know like uh, some people don't agree with it, but you know, it's just how, how I like and uh, how, you know, how, how, you know, how I want to do it. Like, this is my, my take for like bodybuilding right now. So, uh, I, I don't want you to take it, you know, like a different way. Like I, it sounds like I don't take it serious, but I still take it serious. But you know, like it's not about you know, like winning anymore for me. It's more like a love for sports.